Hi, this is Amy with Living My Beloved Life, and this is a stash video. Yeah. So I've had a lot of requests for this one, so here we go. Um, I kind of struggled with how to do it by size, by fabric, by what. Um, so I decided to do it by brand. Um, these first two, though, are 9-inch. These are generics. These are the very first two cloth pads I had, and actually a friend gave them to me. So I just had to show them first. Nine inch charcoal, bamboo charcoal, PUL backed. Um, these are great pads. I still occasionally wear them. Uh, they're a little thick though. I had actually a set of four and I gave two away. Love them though. This is a cloth cycle, bamboo flannel, cotton back. Um, this is considered a light. Dinky dot spots. 9 inch, no 8 inch, sorry. This is a light cotton top fleece back. 10 inch bamboo OBV and fleece back. This is a moderate or a heavy. Delightful rhythms, thong, two thongs, they're 6 inches each, cotton topped and um, fleece backed. Another Delightful Rhythms, this one I actually won um, from a Facebook giveaway, I believe it was. Eight inch, I think, cotton topped, fleece back, love it. That's what actually uh, made me think to try her thongs. Echo Alternatives, I have four of these uh, thong liners, six inches, uh, all flannel. I actually special ordered these to be six inches. They're great. I've had them a year. I use them every cycle, and they're just now starting to pill. Echo Alternatives, 8-inch. This is a moderate or heavy. It's fairly thick. It is a knit top and a fleece back. I was given this in a um, Christmas exchange, so very cool. Amilla pads. These, I think, are considered called Aphrodite. Yep. These are 7 inches each, cotton topped. This Be Mine cotton top is a Penelope. These are 9 inch, I think. Maybe 10. Um, so there's this one. There's the Velvet. Uh, another cotton topped eye. This one is actually an Athene because it's a little bit wider is what I figured out. But it's actually the same length as the Penelope here. Uh, cotton topped. Uh, Star Wars, cotton topped. Next one's Empire Lush. I won these in an auction. This obviously is a cute little bone shape. Cotton topped. This is what she calls a, a ML, so moderate to large. It's like 10 inches to here or 11 if you go to the ends of the bone. Love it. Nice and floppy. Uh, this also I won in that auction, Empire Lush. This is a flannel top, fleece back. Again, one of my favorites. I have so many favorites, really, let's be honest. Uh, Environmentals. This is new. It's a 9-inch. This is a micro, micro fleece. And this is actually the part that you wear against your skin. And a cotton back. 9-something inches, like 9 and a quarter or something. Another Environmentals. This is minky topped. Another cotton back. This is a heavy 11 inches. Did I say that? Can't remember. Uh, Essence of Eve, 7 inch, just a little light liner. It's an OBV. Fanny Tails, 9 inch, and it's a heavy. Maybe this is an 8 inch actually. It's a heavy though. Uh, cute style. And cotton top, fleece back. Fun Pads by Stevens. This is. A bamboo terry, nice and soft, stains like the Dickens though, and a flannel back. Oops, one stack down. These are, let's see, so I'm up to H. Hand sewn by, no, hand sewn by me, and these are all cotton topped, thongs, six inches, all have um, this pretty pink flannel back. Green Cycle, I won this in a Facebook giveaway. Cotton topped, fleece backed. 
uh, I think it is considered a light, I think is what the green means. It's okay. Um, happy flute. This is a nine inch. I like that it has the wider end um, for back or if you want to turn around for front, front bleeding. Charcoal bamboo, charcoal bamboo, bamboo charcoal, whatever, however you want to say that. And a uh, minky, minky back, like that pad. Um, again, my friend gave these to me, so love them. This one is an 11 inch. Hopefully you can see all of that in there. Uh, again, charcoal bam, bamboo charcoal, minky. She actually had given me two more, um, one smaller and one uh, in between size, and I pass those on to my mom as well. Great pads. Happy Moon Pad. What is this fabric? I can't remember. It might be a bamboo flannel. Hemp. That's what it is. It is a hemp. It's this side, actually. Uh, super soft. It has faded tremendously, though, because it used to be almost a red just like that. This is a flannel back, by the way. Um, super soft, though. I really do like it. I think it's considered a heavy. It's fairly thick. Got P-U-L in there. Lazy Creek Boutique. One of my very favorites. I've probably purchased the most from Lazy Creek, uh, although I've given quite a few to my mom because she loves them as well. This is 7 inch liner. Yes, liner. 7 inch light. Cotton topped both of those. 8 inch suede. One of my all-time favorites. This thing holds up like amazing, even though it is considered a liner. Nine inch minky. This is what made me fall in love with minky because I did not think I liked minky at all. And I love this pad. It is so soft. Fleece back, by the way. Uh, Little Bee Creations. This is one of uh, my first pads and my first big go around of purchases. And I actually came in a set of three. This is a nine inch to heavy overnight, flannel topped, flannel backed. I've given the other two to my mom who loves them as well. They're great overnight and just hold up and clean up like troopers. Luna pad, six inch, uh, thong, flannel top, flannel back. Uh, Mama cloth, I actually got this one in a D stash, love it. Seven and a half inches or something like that, cotton topped. And I think it's a flannel back. It might just be a cotton back. It is so soft, though, really. Love it. Novel Red, another one of my all-time favorites. Seven-inch liner cotton topped, fleece backed. This one she actually sent me for free. This is what she calls a ninja pad. It is really light and floppy. It is suede. And is that flannel or... Please, I'm not quite sure. Anyway, this thing holds up fantastic. Uh, what made me fall in love with Novel Red was this pad, this velvet, crushed velvet pad. It, isn't it just dreamy, that color right there? I love, love, love this pad. Now I'm going, why haven't I worn it for a while? Why? Uh, so soft, fleece backed. Novel Red also. This is... Gosh, I think this is Novel Red now that I'm looking at it. I better double check that. I will post uh, somewhere down below if um, it isn't. Anyway, this is a uh, Sherpa. Is that what it's called? I think. Golly, if I would know my stuff. Uh, so soft. Love this pad. And a fleece back. Another Novel Red. This is 11 inch. Uh, oh, it's got some fuzzies on there. Sorry about that. 11 inch, another velvet, just deep royal purple, so soft. This is one of my favorite pads to wear overnight and a fleece back. Wow, lots of fuzzies. So sorry about that. Last stack. Orgo. I got this free when I ordered my one of my cups through her, which I'll show in just a minute. I think this is a seven inch. It's a minky topped and a uh, fleece back. I actually haven't worn it. It's a little on the thick side for me. Um, 
but it is super soft. And like I said before, I didn't think I liked Minky. Pink Lemonade Shop, Raw Silk. This is like a seven and a half inch thong liner and a fleece back. Super pretty deep purple here, but it stains other pads that it's near. This is also the raw silk. Plus the raw silk stains like crazy. I should just do something with those. Popples, this is an 11 inch, I think it's considered a heavy cotton topped, fleece backed. Love it, love it, love it. I think, I'm not positive, but I think that this is a, a cup spot from a sweet, sweet mama dragon, sweet dragon mama. Sweet Mama Dragon, I think is what it is. Uh, cup spot. I got it in that Christmas exchange with the Echo Cloth. So I'm pretty sure that's what it is. This is Sweet Mama Dragon. 11 inch. Um, minky? OBV. Gosh. Sorry, I can't remember. Uh, and then this Houndstooth pink and black um, flannel for the backing. It's so pretty. The stitching on there is just super duper pretty too, isn't it? Tenderoni. Um, flannel. This cute little bear. He's a, like a little, I don't know, eight and a half or nine inch. He's considered a heavy, although he's really pretty thin. I would probably only wear him on a moderate day, but he holds up great for me. Uh, another tenderoni. This little angel, cotton topped, fleece backed. She's wonderful too. Terrapad, I won this one in a giveaway from Facebook. Gosh, when I first started out, my first giveaway actually, it was so sweet, when she was just still not sure she was going to make a pad. She had stopped and started and stopped and started. She stopped for good now. It's a cotton top and a fleece back, and it's considered a moderate or heavy. I can't quite remember. Okay, now everybody pronounces this trojasic, but... I had another viewer who corrected me, and I think it is Trojek. Trojek. Trojek, I think, is the way it's pronounced. Trojek. I'm going to go with that. Um, these were custom order thongs. These are seven, eight inches. Ha uh ha. -huh. Probably about seven and a half. This is a flannel, it's a light. This is a minky and flannel. It is considered a moderate to heavy. This one is an OBV and cotton with um, dog hair, sorry. Um, fleece back, sorry, distracted, and it's considered a panty liner. And this is an eight inch OBV, cotton, and also Trojek, obviously, and a fleece back. I think. Uh, this is a medium to heavy as well. Did I say that? We Essentials, six inch liner, flannel, two pieces of cloth, that's it. Seven, let's see, all of these. Whew, we're getting a little there. Uh, seven and a half inch thong liner, flannel, butterflies, just cute little brown. This was my first one that I just fell in love with and decided I had to have more. Two cute little pink ones, pink tigers. Got these in a D stash. Eight inch flannel. Again, it's a liner, that's it. Another eight inch liner. I love this um, little flowers. And last but not least is a yurt craft eight inch. It is considered a heavy, I believe. Yeah, because it's got the four stars there. Right. Um, it is cotton topped and a fleece back, and it came with that um, Echo Cloth and the Sweet Mama Dragon Cup Spot that I got as a gift. So those are all my um, pads. Whew, that is a lot. And I've given away a lot and tried some and given some away and uh, sold some myself in D-stashes, but I have 30 different brands here. I was really shocked to discover that. And actually, I didn't count how many pads I have right now, so I don't know that. Sorry. Um, some other things that I have that you might want to see are I have a couple of the inner labial pads. I think one of these came from TerraPad and one of them came from Lazy Creek Boutique, and I can't remember which. This is an OBV, 
it's so soft. And this one is flannel, super soft as well. I don't ever use them because I don't have a problem with directing my flow, but I do like them. Uh, cup spots, these are pretty echo intimates. I brought, bought these in a set of six. So four, and I've lost one that should look like that. I don't know where it is. Um, these two are flannels, the rest are cotton. I rarely use these unless I'm using them just as, you know, that last day when I don't really need anything but want something just in case. Uh, these are only like an inch and a half, two inches across, pretty small, and you can tell compared to my other ones. These all came from a millipad, so there's a couple, four cottons and one minky. They're very cute, and minky on the other side, or fleece, I'm sorry, on the other side of these. This one is from Pampered Mama, the little cherries. It seems like kind of a, a stamp print that she was really well known for. Uh, it's a minky, and this is Sherpa, which is so pretty. Then bags, wet bags. This is a little tiny, like four inch. This is from that Crafty Nooks 3559, I think it is. It actually has two pockets here. So this one is unlined. That one is lined, as you can see. It's a little on the small side. I thought I wanted something smaller. Didn't need it. That's all right. Um, these two are little bitty things. These I use the most. Um, both cotton. They're just one pocket, but PUL lined. They just hold enough of what I need and are not too bulky or anything like that. So I like both of those. Bought them in a set that way from Etsy. Pampered Mama. This is considered a cut bag, actually. And it came, so these the cup spot and the cup bag came in a set. And it, I liked the idea of having this little hook on here. I never use it though, I'll be honest. I really do like it though. This bag I do um, use mostly if I'm traveling and I wanna have another bag packed just in case, besides my um, little, bee, little bitty ones. Um, I've had this forever, it came in a set actually. I have another bigger one in my car. And it's, I don't know, like nylon lined. This is like plasticky kind of. It's just a nice bag and it actually bulks up really well. It holds a lot. Uh, this bag I love. This is a simple from Simple Baby Boutique. It is on, she is on um, Etsy. And the thing that I loved about her bag is that it's got actually double straps here. So in my bathroom, I have um, a rack that is like right above my toilet, which is just perfect placement. So I just hang it, you know, right off of the um, hook right above my toilet. Oh my goodness, my bird is mad that I'm talking and not to her. Sorry about that. Um, so this bag is perfect. I also, this is the only large wet bag I have. So the first pocket is just a little cotton line and the second one is the PUL lined, and it holds a ton. Um, I can fit 40 um, family wipes in here and, and then um, a whole bunch of you know, pads and everything else. And I actually leave this on that hook all the time. It's really wrinkled right now. I didn't take it out of the dryer right away. Um, but I just had family come and all I did was just zip it up and I still left it on that hook, so. I haven't used the zipper for a while, so there we go. But this was one of the first bags I purchased, and I fell in love with it, and I've actually ordered others from her for my family, from my mother. So there's my bags, not too many. Then cups, actually, I don't have very many cups. I've tried different cups, but I really, I don't own a whole lot of cups right now. So this is Schoon, this was actually my first cup, and it came with this little bag. Pretty sure this is the bag it came with. Anyway, so there's, I have my schoon. This is the size small, by the way. I cut the stem off. Uh, I have two Malunas. This was my first Maluna. This is a little small soft cup is what it is. It is super soft. It is great for um, light flow days. 
And then this is my Maluna Medium. It is classic firmness. Love this one too. Has this little bag. Um, and then this is probably my newest cup, which is the Lily Intamina um, size A, which is the small collapsible. So, and it is like so soft, silky, smooth. I just love this cup. Whew. We are at a super long video. So anyway, there is my whole stash. So 30 brands of just cloth and then a bunch more of everything else. So I hope you liked this video. I hope you found something you liked. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it and have a great day. Bye-bye.